What's going on? What's going on? It's the Bills. We're over at Club Deco. We just finished watching the movie Star Wars. We sit here with uh, Mr. Bun B at UGK. What's going on? Oh, man, just feeling good, man. Just had a real good uh, real good showing over here at the Museum of Fine Arts, man. Definitely big shout-outs to the Museum of Fine Arts Houston, man. And um, big shout-out to the hip-hop community for coming out and support, man. You know, we showed the movie Star Wars tonight. And um, I think we educated a lot of people tonight on, um, you know, how hip-hop began and the basis of it, you know what I'm saying? I like that. I like that. Hey, I came from seeing that movie Star Wars. I want you to tell me a little bit why you are affiliated with this film and, uh, you know, what hip hop has to do with graffiti. Well, you know, graffiti is one of the four corners of hip hop. You know, the four corners being hip uh, graffiti, rapping, DJing, and uh, b boying, which is breakdancing. And um, I really picked this movie because, you know, with it being a documentary, it's more educational than anything, and it definitely lets you um, get in behind the scenes, you know what I'm saying, to see basically the basis on how everything was built and the foundation. But I thought it was something that people, if they didn't know about hip-hop, they probably needed to see it, and if they did, they probably wouldn't hurt them to see it again. I agree. I definitely uh, agree. Wanna, I've seen it about 20 times, and I still watch it. I came you want to all reiterate on that new uh, disc that you all have coming out, what is going to drop, uh, where did you get your uh, ideas from it, you know what I'm saying? Absolutely. The new album is coming out on April 3rd. It's called uh, Underground Kings, you know what I'm saying, on Jive Records. It's a double album. It's got like 25 songs on it, and um, we're just really trying to bring, you know, what we're doing out here, the Southern Rap Tone music, you know, which is a part of hip-hop. You know, we're just trying to bring what we're doing back to the basics, man, you know what I'm saying? to the foundation on what this music was built on, you know what I'm saying? Like, we got to be doing it for the love. Like, yeah, we want to make money. We got to pay bills and take care of the family and all that, you know what I'm saying? But if it ain't for the love, man, you know what I'm saying? You might make a little money, but it ain't going to be worth nothing, you know what I'm saying? So we just wanted to make sure that we reach back out to OGs like Marley Mall, Too Short, Scarface, Willie D, Gucci Rap, Big Daddy Kane. Then reach out to the next generation of kids as well, you know what I'm saying? And um, just try to make the connection, you know what I'm saying? Let people know, you know, where it started from where it's going to. So, you know, new album, April 3rd, on Jive Records, Underground Kings, UGK. All right, this the biz. We sit here at Deco, sit here with Bun B. That's Giselle. Wait a second. Sure. No. I, got, I got to ask Bun yeah. B one more question now. I just saw that video, The Game Belongs to Me. I know me and you and Tucker have been knowing each other for a while now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Three years now it's been. Anyway, so I, wa I want you to know, I, wa I want the people to know a little bit more about uh, Dr. T. That's what you guys know him as. Let him know uh, about his work back and, and uh, the type of videos that he's putting out, that they're real and why, why, they were, why they are what they are. No, Dr. Teeth is a good cat. You know, I met him. You know, he was uh, producing the Rap City segments for BET back in the day, and um, he wanted to try his hand in directing. You know, I've just been trying to support Houston, you know what I'm saying, movement on all levels, not just the rap movement and the production movement, but the video movement as well. And with Teeth being a local artist, you know, he got a real good sense of what we need and, you know, bring the vision together for Texas and Houston specifically. So, um, you know, I was really happy to work with him over a lot of couple of different videos and extremely happy that he was available to do UGK video because we definitely wanted people to see that, you know, that Texas for what it really is. And well, I don't think there was a better director to get that for the Dr. T, you know. Y'all heard it right here first, like just that. the biz. I said Club Deco's. I'm Courage as thank you. Thank you. Yeah. All right, we are. What's going on? It's the biz. We still out here at Club Deco's. That goes right now at Bun B's after party. You know, we just looked at that movie Star Wars. We sit here with my man. I'm let him introduce himself. I know him from 90.1 host the show down there, man. What's going on at Man, uh, really, we're just uh, having a little celebration of, uh, uh, I think, a pretty big event tonight, bringing a, a rapper like Bun B, really incredible dude, one of the ambassadors of our city, to the Museum of Fine Arts. You know, I mean, you don't see that every day. Uh, you know, bringing somebody like Bun B to the Museum of Fine Arts, you know, he picked an incredible film. It encompasses the arts. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, you know what I mean? It encompasses hip-hop. It's an educational film. Uh, basically, I thought this is just a beautiful thing, really. I agree. It is a beautiful thing. Look, as a beautiful thing that uh, KFPT's got going on. You and Curtis got what, something uh, in common. Go, like I said, yeah. that show on 90. Yeah, plug that show. What's it yeah. called again? It's on KPFT, 90.1 FM, www.kpft.org. It's called Damage Control every Wednesday night, midnight till 3 a.m. Central Time. Me and DJ Chill and a host of like a lot of folks, DJ Gloss, Amy, uh, Golden Child, 
you know, we all come together and just kind of try to present Houston to the rest of the world and the rest of the world to Houston, hip hop wise, basically. Yeah, yeah, I like it that. It's a like show. I've tuned in myself. I like it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, this is the biz. Like I said, we out here at Club Deco right now at uh, the after party for Star Wars. We sitting right here with the man. Y'all keep tuning in. Giselle? Hey, yeah. if you want more information on Damage Control or any of the events we do, you can go to my website. It's a blog called Houston So Real. It's yeah. HoustonSoReal.blogspot.com. And you can get all kinds of information on what we're doing. All the Houston artists, we go all over the world with it. And I uh, appreciate y'all giving us this time. I'm going to get on cool. that. All right, Jay, cool, cool. All right, this is the biz. This has been fun out here. Shazam Productions. We out here having fun club decos. See ya. This the biz right here at Club Decos. We're out here right now at Bun B's after party. That's right, we got it going on. Me and Giselle sitting there talking to Trey right now. I'm uh, gonna ask him a few questions. Like I'm saying, this is rap a lot. We doing our thing. Like I said, it's an all night thing over here at Club Decos. We sat in and we saw that movie, Star Wars. That's right, this is the biz. We out here right now talking to Trey right now. What's going on, Big Dad? I know you want to touch bases on that new mix dig that you just dropped. You want to say anything about it? Yeah, you know, the mixtape Trey the Truth Show. I got a new mixtape coming right after that called AB and Renegades Present Little Boss from Slow Loud and Banging. And my new solo coming, you know, that's going to be a monster. Right? Where did you get the inspiration for this hip mix this that you just dropped? Huh? Where did you get the inspiration for this mixtape that you just dropped? I mean, the mixtape, you know, it just, I dropped that album and caught a lot of people off guard and, and, and made them understand I'm killing the game right now. So I now dropped the mixtape, and the mixtape got everybody from Styles P to Jim Jones to Bun B to everybody on it. You know what I'm saying? Sebo. And I'm still in it, you know what I'm saying? And my new solo is going to come, so I'm on it. Okay, yeah, that's something else I did want to ask you, actually, about, you know, your new video. You got, I, you're going to have a new video coming out soon, I'm sure, with this new album and whatnot. Video already, my video that's out is In the Hood and No Help. Uh, in the Hood, about the debut on MTV2, and No Help probably be coming right behind that. And shit, since my new album finna come, my new video finna come right with that. Yeah, this is the biz. We sit here with Trey right now. Y'all go get that new mixtape coming out, you know what I'm saying? Continue to support him, man. We like what you've been doing. We thank you for sitting down with us and talking to the biz. You know what I'm saying we're going to get some more interview with you later. We sit here right now at Bun B's uh, with his party. After we just finished watching the movie, it's the biz. Y'all tune in. We'll be back.